Well, we are, believe it or not, at the uh, Tiger King Zoo. Yeah, the G GW Exotic, and this. But uh, they just opened up, and yeah. Yeah. We're here. Hi. They didn't really give us much instruction, though. They just said, "Don't stick your arms in the cage." That that's, was, that's all they said. That like it. we walked up, and he said, uh, "We're not charging anything. Uh, don't stick your arms in the cage." Yeah. Because a lot of people are tempted. Don't do it. So we just learned yesterday that when Oklahoma lifted their stay-at-home order, uh, Tiger King Park opened as well. And they actually had to reopen because they were spending anywhere from $2,500 to $5,000 a day to feed the animals. So they were just purging money. They were making nothing. And we are only an hour and 15 minutes from Tiger King Park, so we've decided we are gonna go there today. We haven't done anything interesting in a while, and this feels just very appropriate. And also, this is part of Jessica's Mother's Day present. <laughs> Do I get to play with a cup? <laughs> that experience costs a bit more. Oh, so okay. I get to go look at them. Do you want them. to? He you gets, could. He, he's taking me to the zoo. <laughs> We're gonna chronicle this so that way you can see all of it. Hoping it's not too busy there. All right, we just pulled up to the Tiger King Zoo. And is this what you expected? Um, have obviously haven't seen any tigers yet, but there's like little horsey, I'm, like little ponies. I'm gonna take a video of the entrance so you can okay. see. I mean, the office is right there, which is, it's weird to see in person, but- We parked along this, this just kind of like side road here in the dirt. Yeah, I don't know, it's weird. I was under the impression that a bunch of the tigers got saved and were no longer here. So I'm kind of curious to see how many tigers actually still live in this park. Is this the bear there? But it said like the exotic animals are fifty-five dollars, so I wonder if we can even show the tiger. There's, there's really not that much distance between this barrier, right? Have you ever been this close to a bear before? Uh, actually. This is a little weird, right? I've never, I don't think I've ever seen a bear in real life. Wait, yeah, is this, is this a uh, park what you expected? No, right now it's just like a petting zoo. Yeah. And there's someone walking around. Oh, there's a tiger right there. Oh. I thought right. there was someone in Let's a tiger go. costume. There doesn't appear to be any sort of... Oh my God. <laughs> He's coming after you. Look. No. <laughs> oh my god. That was hilarious. He actually hissed at you. I don't think Jessica realizes there's tigers right here. She's talking about a swan over here. But this is uh this is kinda crazy. There's uh there's not much of a barrier and you can just hop right over, I guess. You got a bug on your forehead. <laughs> and then there's this pretty tiger. Oh my goodness, hi. It, isn't it Did wild how... Look at this. I've never been this close to a tiger before. I don't think you'll ever get this close again. They're beautiful. To any of you. That's so funny. Just keep, it just keeps circling and circling. All right, tell me if this is normal. Look at, it, look at that tiger right there. Look how many flies are on. That's a lot. Hi. Hi. They didn't really give us much instruction though. They just said don't stick your arms in the cage. That that's, was, that's all they said. Like it. we walked up and he said, uh, we're not charging anything. Uh, don't stick your arms in the cage. Yeah because a lot of people are tempted, don't do it. All right, let's walk around. This 
pretty wild. This Every single one of these cages has tigers in it. Explain what just happened. <laughs> what did, explain what just happened. My heart. This tiger right here turned around and just tried to take a piss on us. We jumped to. We, it split us, yeah. It ran. I, I may have gotten a drop on the other. I feel like you definitely got spit on. There's no way that didn't get on you. Getting close to that thing again. Are you insane? You wanted to pee on me so you get it on tape. No, no, no. It's just this is the biggest one so far, right? No, that one over there is the biggest one. This one would eat you for sure. This thing could reach right through the fence, I feel like. I feel like it could oh, break. He's peeing. Is he? Yeah. Why do you have to pee? We have not seen a single worker yet, right? No. There's no adult supervision going on. There's, There's no signs that say, hey, tigers will pee on you. But like, let's say somebody does reach across or something. There's nobody. Nothing to stop you. Like I could throw some of my Chick-fil-A chicken nuggets into a fence that no one would notice. Yeah, this, right. this area 51. Climbing. Right? I'm sure he loves being so like you This bridge. bridge looks like it's going to collapse any yeah. second. Look at this one. That's a big daddy. I'm scared of every bush. You see it moving and I think this way. These things are, really are crammed in here. Right? There's a lot of them. I wish I counted actually. Yeah, but I mean, as big as they are, the cages are fairly, fairly small, right? Yeah, I wonder how often they let them into this big area. You must rotate them all day. Do you think they do or no? I hope that they do. This I almost don't think that they do.
This is very strange. I don't know, there's signs that say, I bite. <laughs> I don't have this. What's this is, in there? This is very strange. Hello, bear. Hello, big bear. I think that's it. Yeah. yeah. That's enough. So it's it's a very small park, right? Yeah. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> so that was weird, right? It was weird. That was, weird experience. There is a depressing feel over that entire place. Yeah, I'm glad you noticed it too. Yeah. And I don't know what the deal is. I don't know if it's just because of who works here, like the conditions of the animals, but. This might sound stupid, but like it's the only thing I can compare it to is like the Animal Kingdom in Disney World when we went on that safari ride. Okay. They built like the landscape of their natural habitat for the lions and the tigers and the elephants and all of those animals and it felt very organic and like we were invading their space but here it's just tigers in cages and yeah it's, it's it, very at, sad at disney they had um like for one lion it was like the size of this place yeah right? like a football field you'd be you'd be shocked at how tiny this whole place is and there's so there's ostriches, there's pigs, there's monkeys, there's fox, there's bear, um, obviously lions and tigers and cheetahs. What else? Turtles. Um, there's ponies, uh, sheep. There's chicken running around. There's there's so many animals. I don't know how they're feeding everyone, especially because they're letting everyone in for free. So yeah. They're yeah. not getting government assistance, that's for sure. I don't know, but this was a, this was a very, very strange experience. Yeah, I would like to see this place closed down and these animals brought somewhere better. Yeah, yeah. But it was an interesting experience. It was. Good road trip. It was, I'm glad we went here so we could see how it really is. Yeah. And I'm glad you all can see how it really is now. Yeah, if you come, be careful. The tigers pee on you. That's true. Hit subscribe! <laughs>